begin Monday's press review in Uganda with Daily Monitor. Locals flee as gang attacks UPDF base. Another story is chaos in Isimingoro district. Go blind. Government is investigating report that dairy farmers in Isingoro district are using unlicensed acaricides and concoctions that are causing blindness and other complications to livestock. The district veterinary officer, Dr. Bohan Kososi, said that they are working with the National Drug Authority, NDA, to ascertain whether the blindness of more than 300 girls is being caused by the said acaricides and chemicals. In Nigeria, the punch carried a story. Buhari government, most wicked in Nigeria's history, Oyedebo. The presiding bishop of Living Faith Church worldwide, also known as Winner's Chapel, Bishop David Oyedebo has said, the present government of Nigeria is the worst thing that has ever happened to the country and that the days of President Muhammad Buhari are numbered. Uyenebo said this on Sunday while delivering a sermon during the second service of the church at the Fed Tabernacle, Ota, Ogun State. Zimbabwe's Herald says, President reaffirms peaceful resolution of challenges. President Mangagwa has reaffirmed his commitment to peaceful resolutions of the country's challenges, saying Zimbabweans needed to collectively create conditions that promote stability. In Cameroon, the star write, Coronavirus outbreaks, beware. Cameroon, amongst 80 countries already infected, over 97,917 cases confirmed worldwide with 3,383 dead. National Episcopal Council of America cautioned bishops, priests, to dissuade Christians from handshake. We end with the voice. Bomb blast Women's Day Parade in Bermuda. West Region. Gunmen wreak havoc in Kalim and Norwegian Council places Cameroon top of most neglected countries in crisis. 